Say something for the Clippers. Um, look, we tried, but if at first you don't succeed, try, 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 overpeak 15 times, try again. Sorry to all the fans, we'll be back stronger. Put it on me. Everyone blames me for all the shit anyways. Just blame me for this loss too. It's all good. I can I can take it. Just fucking pile it up on me. Like unironically, what Toast and other content creators are doing for the tier two scene, but like, dude, it's not just like giving players salary so that they can actually, you know, focus on just playing and not have to focus on like, holy shit, how am I gonna make ends meet? How am I gonna pay rent? Am I gonna get kicked out of the place? Am I gonna get evicted? Blah blah blah. Like you don't have to think about that stuff. Like it's it's important for that. But it's also important for like the health of the overall scene in general when you have people that are coming together to do these watch parties and there's like huge storylines involved and there's huge viewership involved, huge viewership bumps like where you'd maybe have like 2,000 people watching. Now suddenly you're having like 50,000 people. It's like that's really important for the health of the scene. And if you don't have that and the scene starts going under, it's like, well, fuck. It's, it's already looking worse than CSGO's like MDL shit from from you know a few years ago where it's like you have pro league and then it's like you have mdl and then you you'd still have like cash cups fpl and all this other stuff and people were like dude cs is dead in north america it's like bro have you seen valorant like it's it's looking not uh, not sick so no it's absolutely important that toast and others like toast are are doing what they're doing so i mean without that holy shit where would we be